Republicans' pathway to the Senate majority narrowed in the early hours of Wednesday morning, as Lt. Gov. John Fetterman defeated GOP Mehmet Oz in Pennsylvania. It marked the first Senate seat flip of the election, with Democrat Fetterman slated to fill the position currently held by a retiring Senator Pat Toomey, ARPA. That victory came on the heels of wins for Senators. Maggie Hassan, DN. H, a top target for Republicans in a state where polls seemed to tighten in recent weeks, and Michael Bennett, Democrat Colorado, whose re-election was called less than an hour after the state's polls closed Tuesday night. Meanwhile, Republicans held their seats in Florida, Ohio, and North Carolina. But now, assuming GOP Senator Ron Johnson holds Wisconsin, they also need to pick up two of three remaining toss-up races in Arizona, Georgia or Nevada. In Georgia, Herschel Walker and Democratic Senator Raphael Warnock are neck and neck in the polls and could be headed to a runoff election in January. In Arizona, Senator Mark Kelly, Democrat Arizona, is ahead of GOP opponent Blake Masters. And in Wisconsin, Johnson had a small lead over Democratic nominee Lt. Mandela Barnes. We're not sure if this journey is over tonight or if there's still a little work yet to do, 